So does Azempic cause hair loss? This is an interesting question. We don't have a reason why, but yes, in a number of patients, you can see Azempic or other weight loss medications induce hair shedding. And we don't know the full reason why. We think that in some cases it's due to a significant loss of waste. So when you lose waste significantly, you can induce hair shedding called telogen effluvium. And we've known about this for years. It may not be the full story though. There are theories emerging about how some of the impact of these medications may induce changes in the way that regulates hair growth. So there's a lot of work to be done on this, but we can see very significant hair shedding. People coming in saying, I have just suddenly seen two to three months after I started this medication, um, quite a lot of hair shedding. We think based on some initial data, maybe in about 7% of cases of people taking it, maybe more, maybe less. We certainly need a lot of research to try and get us to a point where we understand what are all the reasonings. It's an unusual one because uh, last year there was a case report of a patient who actually showed some hair growth when on uh, one of these types of medications. Now one swallow doesn't make a summer. But there is a little bit of a theory as to how these medications may improve hair growth as well. So I think there's an awful lot to be done. It's certainly very problematic for people. The advice at the moment is, is that we expect the hair loss to start reducing over time as your waist starts to plateau. Um, and then because in most cases it seems to be a very temporary induction of shedding, it should be something that starts to recover over time. But again, a lot to be discovered here.